welcome to Cecil Avenue Middle School. If you follow me, I'll take you out to our brand new gymnasium. This gym rat crib is called the Lon Spurrier Athletic Facilities. Lon Spurrier was an Olympic athlete who came from this area in Delano, went on to great Olympic success, and when we built this new crib in honor of him and his family, we named our athletic facilities after him. We're here at the front doors of our gym. Come with me as we enter through the doors, we'll show you what a state-of-the-art facility looks like. Part of the pride of our program is this portable stereo that we have to use for our aerobics program and all the dancing and everything else that we need. One of the great things we did with the gym is when we set it up, we set it up so the stereo can be plugged in anywhere in the gym, on any wall. We have our speaker system up there on the wall, 10 speakers to help our aerobics program and all of our dance music. And the sound is great in here. We have acoustic tiles all over the walls to deaden the sound so that it minimizes the echo. And we can use this anywhere we want. We get to play music and the kids love it. Here's what it sounds like. touches that you'll see around our gym and one that the average person wouldn't notice are these outlets. These type of outlets here are placed all around the walls uh, of the gymnasium. You see we have a cable outlet so if we ever need to get into a cable or TV station for whatever reason we can and we have the flexibility to do it wherever. The other thing is, is you'll notice that we have these internet jacks here. These are spread out on every wall of the gym and anytime that we need to use the internet for a large group lesson we can just plug in and access the district's network and we can use those kind of lessons anywhere that we want to do them in the gym. One of the great features of our gym is whenever we are doing large group presentations or when we're teaching dance, we can project an image from the internet, the computer, uh, an overhead, or just on the camera of myself or any of my colleagues up on this great uh, big white screen. This allows all the kids in the gym to see what's going on know what's happening if some if we're leading a dance up in front and we've got a classroom full of 200 kids then everybody that whether you're in the front or the back can see what's going on it's one of the things that we're most proud of and was part of the planning stage see slamming the pe motto experiencing the adventure every day is an adventure for us and we ask our kids to come along and join the adventure with us and welcome to see slamming the fitness lab this is our baby this is the thing that we're most proud of and we're unique in this part of Kern County and that we were the first ones to have something like this at the middle school level. So let me take you around real quick and show you some of our equipment. First of all, we'll start with our treadmills. Um, the aerobic capacity of our students was a big concern for us, so we bought a lot of aerobic equipment because kids just don't get enough exercise to build their cardiovascular system in the lane. When we come over here, first again, uh, this is a full body workout, but it also works the cardiovascular system really well. We come over here to the thing that the kids are about and this is stereo that we're blasting music while they're working out. Um, we let them pick the songs at times as long as they're appropriate. And uh, music's going and really helping to motivate the kids to uh, work out and stay really physically active. We also have some storage in here as well. You can see we have some steppers for our classes to do step aerobics with. Um, we continue our cardiovascular workout with our elliptical trainers. Again, these are state-of-the-art ellipticals, uh, self-generating power. Um, we have five of those that we use in a state Modular weight station. There are eight stations uh, going around, so they use this as a circuit, and they'll do mini workouts and rotate around uh, every time we ring a bell to different stations to uh, get a circuit training effect um, for their fitness regimen. Hey, here we have our gym balls to work out the core uh, for the students. We also do a lot of different activities. One of the best pieces of fitness equipment for the money is cheap, and there's hundreds of different things you can do with them. Electronic fitness tracking system we can use uh, for fitness gram to track our students' fitness over time through sixth, seventh, and eighth grade and create electronic portfolios of their fitness that they put in their physical education portfolios to follow them from sixth, seventh, and eighth grade. And finally, here's the thing that we're proudest of. We just started getting into electronic.
electronic fitness, video game fitness. We have two Canai game bikes here uh, with a plan for three more to put a station in. And we also have two DDR dance pads with the plan to add more dance pads as we go through and we're able to get some more money. As you can see, the game bikes work just like the video game. You have a controller on here, but in order to make the motorcycle go, you have to pedal. So the kids are able to score points and do tricks and flips and race each other. But in order to go, they've got to pedal and the kids just love it. This is the one station we can't get the kids off of. Same thing with DDR here. They can uh, compete against each other doing dances from the easiest to the hardest versions. Um, they push themselves, they choose their own levels, and they're able to uh, maximize their workout and have a great time and don't even realize they're exercising. This is the way to the future and this is the way to go. Here's our gym rat fridge. Another perk of working in Delano. We got all the good stuff here and we open the door and look inside you see that there is nothing in there. So we got a fridge, but we don't have anything to put in it. So anybody who sees this video, send all your contributions to the Cecil Avenue Refrigerator to Cecil Avenue Middle School, Delano, California, in care of Lionel Reyna. Walk from the office to our little changing room. We have our own toilet, first class, with our own shower.